This is an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar called Ask Larry Anything. Hi, my name is Larry Jordan. In this short video tutorial, I'll show you how to embed labels called metadata into video files that can be viewed later during playback. These files could be ProRes or MPEG-4, MPEG-3, or QuickTime. Dave asks, is there a way of embedding and saving information in a QuickTime file? Information such as the director of a video, which is then searchable. Information that can also be read on a PC other than resorting to a database application. And the answer is yes. If you do a Google search for add metadata annotations in Compressor, Apple will walk you through a variety of ways that we can use Compressor to add metadata. In fact, this technique works with ProRes files, MPEG-4 files, MPEG-3 files, QuickTime files. But whether it is searchable or not depends upon the application that is accessing the file. There's no standard here. Let me illustrate. If we switch to Compressor, let's say that I want to add some metadata to it. Notice that I do not yet have a compression setting assigned to it. So I'm going to select the, the movie itself, not the compression setting. Select the movie. Go over to the inspector in the job category and scroll down to where it says metadata. We can then add a job annotation. We can add a comment. Or we can add a director. Or we could add, say, a title. And so we'll say the title, double click. Forging Steel, bum, bum, bum. And the director is me. And the comment is this, whoops, got it. No, stop, got to get the box selected. This is rough cut, ready for comments. Now when I compress this, this metadata will go in every compression setting as long as it's ProRes or MPEG-4 or MPEG-3 or QuickTime. The cool thing is I can add this metadata to any movie that I'm compressing, whether it was created inside Final Cut or not. This was an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar called Ask Larry Anything. For the complete version of this online training, please visit my store at larryjordan.com store and look for Webinar 313. By the way, when you need to stretch your training dollars, membership in our video training library saves you money and time. You can access all our videos for a low monthly price of only $19.99. That's almost 2,000 movies, hundreds of hours on a wide variety of subjects. Plus, premium members can download practice media and projects. Our training covers Apple and Adobe software. We update it multiple times each month. And for more information, visit LarryJordan.com slash membership. And thanks.